tug on the line You can't believe its strength As the fight begins You work hard and bring it over the side Man, it feels good to reel this monster in Colorado Fishing Adventures Hello everyone, thank you again for joining the channel today Today's video, fortunately, it's dark out, not on the water, but I am wanting to do another product review that um, I came across and um, I actually purchased uh, three separate ones of this. A lot of you may have heard of it and know of it, may already use it. It's called the Raptor Tackle Roll. I love it. For me, it's like perfect for being a kayaker and doing a little bit from shore. So. Um, I'm going to kind of show you previously what I had used, and I still got a lot of them here, but I, I don't use them anymore. It was basically the Plano. Um, it was too cumbersome, too bulky. So for me, I wanted to find something a little bit different. And on Facebook, I came across this and was just kind of waiting a little bit for more and some comments and saw a lot more comments and some good praise for it. So I wanted to do a video of the three sizes that I have. So uh, I basically got, <laughs> jokingly I say this, it's the baby bear, mama bear, and papa bear. So it's the, the Goldilocks threesome. So that's what I call it. Um, but as you have here, you've got the SLU, I'll start off with this one, the SLU 20. You then have the BH 24. And then you got the CP54. So what that actually means with the numbers is how many, for the most part, slots and, and spots you can kind of put in there um, for your lures. Lures. I use the smaller one right now for anything that's basically from shore or if I'm out for like a couple hours somewhere, either on the water or walking around to do a little bit. So I don't want to bring too much with me. The middle one is basically if I'm out a little bit longer, I'll still maybe bring the small one, but the middle one is for something a little bit longer when I'm out kayaking, maybe doing a tournament somewhere, so on and so forth. If it's even really long, probably both of them um, like that. And the large one is like a storage unit for me. Um, I do have some, as you can see here, I've got some storage going along here and along the wall here too. But for me, I wanted something else besides these bulky Plano um, boxes here. So I've got a few of them. I'm trying to, to sell them off because I am sold on this, this Raptor Tackle Row. So what I'd like to do here, I'm going to kind of walk through them a little bit here, kind of show you what I've got in here and how it kind of works. And then hopefully um, I'll, I'll add a link below to for them. Um, you can get some discounts. You can get some really great product from it. I, mean, I love it. Um, and and they, the customer service is, is outstanding. I, I've talked to actually the owner a couple times of, of this company. And that's that to me means a lot when you can actually talk to somebody who is the owner and we'll jump on things pretty quickly. So stay tuned and we'll walk through each one. All right. All right. So the first one I have here, I'm going to open this thing up here. It's great because it's got the Velcro. Um, you can kind of roll this thing up any way you want to to kind of get this thing going here. So I'm just going to show you here. So you've got basically, and you got here two hooks if you want to, what I've done, or not hooks, I should say, holes, if you want to hang them up on the wall, I've done that too before. But if you get, look, you got some smaller pockets. So you got, uh, let's see here, you got six, you've got nine of the real small, the smaller pockets. So you can put, as I do the hooks in here, I've got some, some other stuff. I got my fishing license, I got a few other things. So there's spots in there. And then you've got the larger ones that come after that. So you got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, uh, 15s, right? So is it 9, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 20. That makes sense. That's the 20 pockets. So in here, I'll put a little variety in here. This bottom one here is bigger than the others. So you can put the bigger, bigger items in here. Um, and again, it's got this uh, mylar in here, uh, which is great. It's 
this stuff, the only thing sometimes occasionally that you may have and make it hung up here, but in general, you can pull these things out with ease. Um, I've learned there's different ways to kind of put some of these things in here. I think a few of these, I probably got them, should flip them around, it'll stick in a little bit better, but this thing, you know, is a perfect size for some beginners maybe. If you're just gonna be going from shore, uh, or doing light, light fishing, light tackle, stuff like that, this is a good product. This is, I think, perfect uh, for, for, for me. I use this on my last video, which was posted, which was the one for the Northern Pike. This is all I brought, um, along with this bag with a few other things inside there, but it just made things easy. Like you say, you just roll this thing up and you're solid. You're, you're, you're there. It's, 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 you know, it's, it's, it's great to have, um, and compact when you look at this thing overall. So that is the first one. I'm gonna put this one off to the side. Let's get, not the larger one. I know I pulled that over here. Let's get the medium one. Kind of show you that one, okay? So it's the same thing, the Velcro. I'm trying to do this as I got the recording in the other hand, so bear with me, people. Again, this is the same thing. It's just longer. You got more pockets, more of the bigger pockets too. Um, the one thing I did notice, and it's, it's, it's not a bad thing, I, I use some scents, so it kind of stains it, but that doesn't matter. It, it, that's nothing wrong with that. Um, doesn't puncture. Occasionally, if you really press hard, it will, but you can get these things in and out with, with ease, total ease. So again, you got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24 pockets. These down here are a little bit bigger. Like these two down here are bigger compared to the others that we have going on here. So you got two down here that are larger. You can probably fit some larger ones in here. It's that same thing. If you got a lot of variety, this one here was more or less uh, my... Um, Longer tournaments that I put stuff in here, and also my my top waters. I kind of keep the top waters in there. A few other things that you can put in here too, and it's the same thing. You got the holes, uh, the grommets, as they say in here, and all, it's the same process. You're just gonna take this thing and roll that thing up. Sometimes they like say it's a little bit colder now, so these things are a little bit more, um, you know, not as uh, easy to bend, but the, it'll still roll. It's still going to get there. It's going to keep everything in here. I'm shaking this thing here. You're you're good. It, it's all good. Again, this is the BH24. So this is another good product that I have. Again, like I said, I've got all three of them. So here's the two. And now let me bring the big boy out and show you that one. So this is the same thing, same exact product, just bigger, more pockets. This is the, again, the CP54, okay? I should let you know, this is not a paid advertisement from me. I just like to do some of the stuff that I really like on the waters and give my true review of them. Here, as you can see, you got a lot more. You got 54, is that what it is? 54 pockets, I believe it is. Um, I should also say the very top ones are different than the others. Because what they do here, all after the top one, the pockets here on this, you gotta flip it up to get to the pocket. So um, a little bit different on that. But again, you got the same thing. So you got four, eight, 12, this one I need to move over and out of there. I just threw in there. So this one here, I felt a little poke through. It will poke through on occasion, but for the most part, I go like this, I'm not getting stuck at all. But again, I don't need to go through all the pockets here, but this is my storage one. So I will store stuff in here that doesn't fit or doesn't go on this wall or on that wall. But it's the same exact thing, waterproof, Easy to pull it out, easy to unravel inside my kayak. I got my kayak here, so what I will do is I will take and just roll it out in front of me. Pick what I need, and then usually in the back here, I will have my storage. Apologize for the light. Um, you may not be able to see it as well, but I, I do apologize for that. Um, 
but I'll put the, my tackle box um, here uh, so that way it's easy to kind of take in and out. So for me, you got each one of these things that are different aspects of the fishing, different properties on when you may want to use something, how you want to use it. Actually, use it any way you want. That's my philosophy. I'm just giving you my true opinion on this product. I love it. I enjoy it. It's great for me on the waters. This, that's a no-go for me anymore. I may get some comments from people saying, oh, how can you do that? I'm like, this that's my opinion. This is a, a video that I wanted to put out and in regards to my opinions and, and what I feel like is better for, again, I think this might be great. It's great for boaters too. I've seen that too. It's great for me as a kayaker. It's great for me being from shore. Um, right now, I think they got a pretty decent deal that's going on too for the holidays. So give it a try, everyone. Um, I, again, this is just one man's opinion. You might see others. Uh, I'll put a link down below and um, hopefully you can give them a try. I think you will definitely like them. Maybe try one of them first off and then try others. That's what I did. I went with the um, uh, the medium first, then I went to the large, and then I just recently got the small. So I, I went bit by bit to give them a try. So again, everyone, thank you for joining the channel. Thank you for letting me give you my opinion on, again, Raptor Tackle Roll. And um, please, if you haven't, hit subscribe, hit the like button, hit the notification bell, and more videos will be coming. I'll even have probably more product uh, reviews coming up. May do another one. I've seen stuff, you know, my top five YouTube fishing videos, or not videos, uh, top five fishing YouTubers. Um, and a couple other things I think that just starting to pop up here. So I, I hope you enjoy this one. Again, do everything they said, subscribe, like, notification bell, all right? Thank you everyone for joining and we'll talk to you soon and thanks for playing.